Hello, my friends. Yesterday I gave you a sneak preview into the chapter in Mark that we read together last night. And right now I'm going to give you a sneak preview into the next chapter that we're going to be in tonight. This preview, I kind of jump all over the first four books of the gospel in the New Testament, but they're all related. And so here we go. We're going to start. I, I did put them in order this time. We're going to start in Matthew and go through uh, John. And I, I retract what I said about them being in order this time. The last two are not in order. Well, the second to last one is, but the last one is not because I wanted those two saved for the end to kind of wrap up what I was saying. So the last one is not in order. All the rest of them are. <laughs> and I'm not in order. I'm never in order, but these scripture are except for the last one. All right, we're going to start in Matthew chapter 4, verse 1. Well, my note there doesn't match the Bible, but I'm going to go by the Bible. Matthew 4, verses 18 through 20. And Jesus, walking by the Sea of Galilee, saw two brethren, Simon, called Peter, and Andrew, his brother, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishers fishermen. I guess they called them fishers back then. And Jesus said unto them, follow me and I will make you fishers of men. And they, talking about uh, Simon Peter and Andrew, his brother, and they straight away, straight away, left their nets and followed him, Jesus. Straight away. They didn't take their fishing equipment home. They didn't do anything. They straight away followed Jesus. And next we're going to go to still in Matthew chapter 9, verse 9. And as Jesus passed forth from thence, he saw a man named Matthew sitting at the receipt of custom, and he saith unto him, Follow me. And he, speaking of Matthew, arose and followed Jesus. Now we're going to hop over to the book of Mark. Chapter 1, verses 16 through 20, except I'm going to change that. No, I'm not. I'm going to leave it. I was looking at the wrong chapter. All right. Matthew, I mean Mark, chapter 1, verses 16 through 20. Now, as he, talking about Jesus, walked by the Sea of Galilee, he saw Simon and Andrew, his brother, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishers. Well, that's what I just read you, except in Matthew. But here you get it again. And Jesus said unto them, Come ye after me, and I will make you to become fishers of men. And straightway they forsook their nets and followed him. And when he had gone a little way further thence, he saw James, the son of Zebedee, and John, 
his brother, who were also in the ship, mending their nets. And straightway he called them, and they left their father Zebedee in the ship with the higher servants and went after him. And now we're going to go to Luke. Chapter 9. Verses 57 through 60. Luke chapter 9, verses 57 through 60. And it came to pass that as they went in the way, a certain man said unto him, Lord, I will follow thee whithersoever thou goest. And Jesus said unto him, Foxes have holes, and birds of the air have nests, but the Son of Man hath not where to lay his head. And he said unto another, Follow me. But he said, Lord, suffer me first to go and bury my father. And Jesus said unto him, Let the dead bury the dead, but go thou and preach the kingdom of God. John chapter 12. John chapter 12, verses 25 and 26, and this is all Jesus speaking. He that loveth his life shall lose it. And he that hateth his life in this world shall keep it unto life eternal. If any man serve me, let him follow me. And where I am, there shall also my servant be. If any man serve me, him will my father honor. And then the last verse I want to share is back in Luke again, chapter 14. Verse 27, and this is also Jesus speaking. Jesus said, And whosoever doth not bear his cross and come after me cannot be my disciple. If you're a true Christian, God is calling you to serve him. Did you do like the disciples and straight away follow when you were called? That's the response Jesus should get. And we should have a big smile on our face when we do it. That's that, y'all. This may be the shortest video I ever made, except for the short shorts. And I've done two of those today. I just love spending time in God's Word. 
Some, sometime I need to cook though. I, I did laundry. I got laundry in the dryer now. I already washed it. I just had one load this time. I guess because it's cold, I hadn't been going out. But anyway, because when I go out, I wear different clothes than what I wear around the house. So that means two sets of clothes got dirtied those days. And I hadn't been going out except yesterday to physical therapy. And I go again tomorrow, I think it is. No, tomorrow I've got a doctor appointment. I guess it's Friday I have another physical therapy. Yeah, that's the way it is. Doctor appointment tomorrow and physical therapy again on Friday. That's that for now, y'all. God bless you. I love y'all.